was to Yusuf. Let mother continue. Mom, can you go on? What happened to Isa? Maryam carried Isa and took him to her people. The people looked at her in amazement and said, Maryam, you have done something terrible. Your parents were good people. How could you? Explain who this baby is. Allah told Maryam through the angel Gabriel that if she were to meet any man, she should let them know that she was fasting from talking to anyone. Then she pointed to the child. The people exclaimed, How could we speak to a baby? Then Isa spoke to them. What? The baby spoke, but babies can't speak. How could Isa speak? The mighty power of Allah made Isa speak even though he was a baby. It was Allah's miracle. Isa told them, I am truly a servant of Allah. He has destined me to be given the scripture and to be a prophet. He has made me a blessing wherever I go and told me to establish prayer and give zakat as long as I live and to be kind to my mother. He has not made me arrogant or defiant. Peace be upon me the day I was born, the day I die and the day I will be raised back to life. قال إني عبد الله آتاني الكتاب وجعلني نبيا وجعلني مباركا أينما كنت وأوصاني بالصلاة والزكاة ما دمت حيا وبرا بوالدتي ولم يجعلني جبارا شقيا والسلام علي يوم ولدت ويوم أموت ويوم أبعث حيا How fascinating From that moment on, the people were very cruel to Isa and Maryam they didn't want to believe what Isa said. That must have been tough for Miriam. Yes, it wasn't easy for her. But Miriam took care of her baby. He grew up in Jerusalem and Allah protected him from all evil. Isa, peace be upon him, received the revelation from Allah to remind people to only worship Allah and do justice in society. He tried to reason with them, the children of Israel. He reminded them to avoid evil and obey Allah. But they refused to believe in him. They found it difficult to listen to Isa and follow him. They were very mean to him. That's not nice. Allah gave the Prophet Isa peace be upon him miracles to prove that he was a prophet sent by Allah. What's a miracle? A miracle is a sign that Allah gives the prophets. It is something amazing and cannot be done by people. Do you remember any examples of the other prophetic signs? Yes, Prophet Moses' staff that turned into snake. Well done, Yusuf. I know Prophet Solomon could talk to animals. Good, Sana, mashallah. What was the sign of Prophet Isa? Allah gave Isa, peace be upon him, a sign that suited the society he belonged to. His people used to be interested in medicines and treatment. So Prophet Isa could cure those who were blind and those who had a skin disease. He could even bring the dead to life. He did all this through Allah's will. Whoa! Prophet Isa could also shape the clay to resemble a bird. Then he blew on the mud and it turned into a real bird with Allah's permission. How cool! Not only that, but Allah gave him knowledge that others did not know. For example, Isa knew what kind of food people had stored in their houses without visiting them. And he also knew what people had eaten earlier in the day without having seen them eat. I should follow him. Prophet Isa said to his people, I have come unto you with a sign from your Lord. Fear God and follow me. Allah is my God and your God. You have to worship him. I should follow him. Me too. Unfortunately, the majority of his people showed resistance and unwillingness to believe in him. Then Isa, peace be upon him, asked the people, Who will help me to call man to Allah's way? A small group called al Hawariyun replied in the Quran, We are Allah's helpers. 
We believe in Allah and you bear witness that we have submitted to his will. They call Al-Hawariyun the disciples of the Bible. I read about the disciples in the religious studies. So the disciples were like the companions of Prophet Muhammad. Yes. Now, one day, the disciples, Al-Hawariyun, Ask the Prophet Isa for a very strange thing. What? They asked the Prophet Isa if Allah could give them a table set with food from heaven. Isa said, Fear Allah if you have faith. They said, We only wish to eat from it and satisfy our hearts, and know that you have told us the truth. But what should Isa do? So Isa, peace be upon him, prayed to Allah and ask him to send down a table from heaven to be a sign from him. Allah accepted his prayers and sent down a table set with different food. Everybody ate from it, not only the disciples. You can read more about it in the fifth chapter called Al-Ma'idah, the heavenly meal in the Qur'an. I want to read about it. How exciting that everything is in the Qur'an. Was the food yummy? <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm getting hungry. But really, did they eat the food? Of course, they ate the food and thanked Allah for it. But some others were ungrateful and continued to deny Allah. Hatred grew even more in some of the people. They became jealous of the Prophet Isa and they planned to get rid of him. What? They visited the Roman Emperor and spoke ill of the Prophet Isa claiming that he was a threat to the throne. The emperor believed them and became angry. He decided to kill Isa. So the emperor commanded his soldiers in Jerusalem to kill Isa. Ya Allah! Yes, it was. But Allah saved him. Allah told the prophet Isa peace be upon him about the emperor's plan. According to some interpretations, Isa was in the house with his disciples. He said, who among you volunteers to be made to look like me and killed in my place? He will be my companion in paradise. The youngest man among them stood up and said, It is I. Prophet Isa said kindly, Sit down. Then he repeated his question. The youngest man stood up again and said, It is I. Isa again said, Sit down. Then Isa repeated his question a third time. That youngest man said, It is I. At that, Prophet Isa said, You it is. That volunteer in person was made to look like Isa. When people came to capture Isa, they thought this young man was Isa. So they took him and crucified him. Oh no, that's awful. Before this, Prophet Isa, peace be upon him, was raised from a window in the upper corner of the house. Normally people use this window to get to the roof. Prophet Isa, peace be upon him, was raised through it. But did the Prophet Isa get up? Yes, when the young man died, the soldiers thought it was Isa who died. They became unsure if they had got hold of the right person, but spread the word further that it was Isa. al Hawariyun were the only ones who knew the whole truth. Allah says in the Quran, and for their saying, we have killed the Messiah Jesus, the son of Mary, the messenger of Allah. And they did not kill him, nor did they crucify him, but another was made to resemble him to them. And indeed, those who differ over it are in doubt about it. They have no knowledge of it except the following of assumption. And they did not kill him for certain. Rather, Allah raised him to himself, and ever is Allah exalted in might and wise. وَقَوْلِهِمْ إِنَّا قَتَلْنَا الْمَسِيحَ عِيسَى بْنَ مَرْيَمَ رَسُولَ اللَّهِ وَمَا قَتَلُوهُ وَمَا صَلَبُوهُ وَلَكِنْ شُبِّهَ لَهُمْ وَإِنَّ الَّذِينَ اخْتَلَفُوا فِيهِ لَفِي شَكٍ مِّنْ مَا لَهُمْ بِهِ مِنْ عِلْمٍ إِلَّا اتِّبَاعَ الظَّنِّ وَمَا قَتَلُوهُ يَقِيْنًا
بل رفعه الله إليه وكان الله عزيزا حكيما. What happened to the Prophet Isa? Prophet Isa is up in heaven. He's going to come back just before life on this world ends. Is that true? Will we be able to see the Prophet Isa? It would be so cool to be able to meet a prophet. If we live until then, we can. What is he going to do? He will come back because Allah wants to prove to the people that Isa was an ordinary man who was chosen to be a prophet to guide those who worship only Allah. That he is not God or the Son of God as many people believe. He will come back to die. All men will die before Allah awakens them again to eternal life. So we believe in Prophet Isa, peace be upon him. We love him like all other prophets, and we appreciate his quest to guide people to the right path to Allah. We do not believe that Isa is God or the Son of God, as in Christianity, but we love him just as Christians do. Now I understand. So the Prophet Isa is like the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon them. Can I tell my teacher at school about the Prophet Isa? Absolutely. We can write down the story together so you can remember it. Do you want to hear the verses from Surat Maryam, where Allah mentions both Isa and Maryam to help you remember everything? Yes. Yes. Yes, we yes, do. ذلك عيسى بن مريم قول الحق الذي فيه يمترون ما كان لله أن يتخذ من ولد سبحانه إذا قضى أمرا فإنما يقول له كن فيكون وإن الله ربي وربكم فاعبدوه هذا صراط مستقيم